sparkle gear. I have another unboxing today. Shall we get into this and see what's in it? Um, just get the, this open. Hope you're all feeling well today. Excuse the noise. It's a little bit noisy. Now, yesterday I did an unboxing of a Diamond Art Club, which was a Randall Spangler. And as I was describing um, the diamond painting, I could not read what was on the Literate Dragon's reading book, the book he was reading. The book is called The Complete Works of William Shakespeare. And um, that um, my husband had to translate when he got home last night. Okay, so we have a diamond art club. Yay! Let's see what's in this. You can get into it. And it doesn't want to come out of the box today. Now this is going to be a Chuck Pinson. One I've been waiting for for quite some time. Um, the last time I tried to purchase this, it had been um, sold. It was sold out, so I tried again and uh, managed to get hold of it. Okay, let's get this out of the box. It does seem like quite a big um, diamond art. Now it is a square, as you can see there. Um, the ribbon is a square, beautifully boxed as normal. Anything else in there? No. Alrighty. Now it comes with your regular tool kit, self-explanatory, um, two pieces of wax, a four-placer, your squishy, plastic bags, and also your tweezers and your pen. Sorry my shadow's in this. I think it's the lighting in here today. I have got two lights on. Now, what have we got? Okay, Inspirations of Spring Meadow. This is a Chuck Pinson. As I said before, it is a square. It's 93 by 70, so it's quite a big one. Um, to fit the frame, 36 by um, 36, uh, sorry, 36.6 inches by 27.6 inches. And it's quite a pretty picture. So let's have a look and get into this. I've been unsure about what diamond painting to do. Um, I have been just dabbling at a couple of like snacks diamond paintings um, because of just having the surgery. But I'm thinking I might start um, this one. All right, let's roll. Oh, this is, look at the colours. Oh, this is just beautiful. I have to move that along a little bit. I hope I didn't nudge the camera then. Pop the corner of that box under there. So what do we think of this? Look at those colours. They're just stunning. So there are 54 colours in this. And there are, if you get this right today, two ABs number one and number two 
So this is the larger picture. You can put your start and end date on this one. It is a Chuck Pinson and of course your stickers that will peel off. So it's one of the new um, boxes of diamond paintings. So we have got on this, we've got butterflies. We have got a rabbit. And my shadow is just not doing this any good. Let me just switch off a light. We'll see if this makes any difference to my shadow. That is a little bit better. Yeah, that's much better. Okay, so we have, as I said, butterflies, rabbits, lots of flowers. Lots and lots of flowers. Some rocks over here. Over here, there are a couple of deers. I'll bring this up a little bit closer. A cabin with a rocking chair and the smoke coming out of the cabin there. There is a bird up here in the sky. Um, we have, there's two deers there and there's one on this side. Beautiful pinks and lilacs and mauves. This is just beautiful. Now, um, as I said, 54 colours, and we're looking for number one and number two. One is a white, and two is a lemon colour. Now, we will have a look. Okay. It being so big, I'll have to fold it over, I think. So your twos are up in here, all through there. They're also down along here, through there. There'll be some in the flowers, which will be down here, through here, through the trees. And number one, the white, will be in the flowers down the bottom, which are here, across here, and also open it out again. Also, there will be. in the sky through here. So that's your number ones. I'm probably going to put a few more ABs on this. I will probably put some in some of the darker pinks in the trees over here and up in here. Um, and maybe just a few more in through the mountains at the top there. So as I said, this is a 93 by 70 to fit a frame size of 36.6 by 27.6. We'll just do a bit of a sticky test here. Quite sticky, very sticky. As always, your diamond art, the canvases are scalloped around the edge. To stop any fraying and this is just going to look beautiful in its frame once I've finished it I must admit I'm going to be running out of walls to put them in frames and my biggest portfolio um, this will not fit in it so I'm not sure how I'm going to go with that these are the colors so they are Pinks, blues, greens, again on this side, but they're just, they're just gorgeous. 
So I won't take these out of the bag today. Um, they're quite difficult, I've found, to try and get back into their bags. So I just thought I'd show the colours like that today. But yes, I would like to start this on first. I know I've got a lot. So I know um, my Randall Spanglers, um, I probably should be starting one of those first. But this, I have been really excited to get this. I think I saw Jenny um, unbox this one. And she tried so hard to get it um, on her site. Uh, on her YouTube but um, I think some friends ended up sending it to her which was lovely we all need friends don't we okay so that's my unboxing for today um, I will have a whip and chat coming up um, I know this is a short video but I just wanted to get this unboxed today just to show you all uh, there will also be um, the whip and chat after that of our holiday that we had in Lawn um, three weeks ago now and there'll be some more photos we upload of um, the beach and the places we went to up there I hope you enjoyed that last one um, but yeah I am enjoying doing the videos I'm sorry we had that big break but um makes it very difficult to concentrate on diamond art um, any sort of di any sort of craft when your eyes not working too well um, so that's it so I think for me today again the canary is singing trying to get his word in as well which is lovely I hope you don't mind all that singing um, let me know what you're working on and if you like this video give me a thumbs up send me some comments send me questions and if I can answer them I will um, and I'd like to thank all my subscribers and if you would like to subscribe just hit that bell and you'll be notified when another video comes up on YouTube so anyway, you all have a good day. Enjoy what you're doing, whether it be diamond painting or knitting or sewing. Um, just enjoy what your hobbies are. And we'll talk again soon. This is Sue Sparkle. Bye.